Hey guys, this is Nathan from North 40 Fly Shop Great Falls and today I'm going to be tying for you a Miller Time Baby Brown. Okay, and for this fly I'm going to start out with a Gamakatsu size 2 B10 stinger hook. I'm going to put that in the vise and start a thread base on it. Cut off the tag end there. Once you get a pretty good thread base down, I'm going to get a pair of Spirit River dumbbell eyes, and I chose yellow for this fly. I'm going to be tying them on the underside of the hook, about an, a little more than an eyes gap behind the front. Get a bunch of good crisscross wraps on those. Tighten them down so they don't spin around on you. And once I get these tied in good, I like to use a little bit of UV goo and put it on here so they just to lock them down a little bit more. Let that soak in a little bit and hit it with the UV light. I'm going to wrap back to the back of the hook. Now for the tail and the body of this fly, I'm going to use brown barred rabbit strip. Get about a four inch piece of that. Find where about where you want it. And stroke the fibers forward to tie it in. Get a couple tight wraps there on the rabbit strip and tie in front. And for some of the flash in the body of this fly, I'm using pearl coral core braid and pearl white. Cut off a pretty good sized strip of that and tie it in right in front of the rabbit. And then bring your thread up just behind the eyes. And then go ahead and wrap the pearl braid forward. And tie it off right behind the dumbbell eyes. And then trim that off. Now for the underbelly of the fly, I'm gonna use ice dub and pearl. I'm gonna invert the fly, get out a piece of ice dub. And pull the fibers apart and stack them together like this so you get them all facing the same direction. Once you have that done, you're going to tie it in right behind the dumbbell eyes. And on top of that, I'm going to put some ice dub orange. I'm do the same thing with that as I did with the pearl ice dub. Get all the fibers lined up. And then tie that in right behind the dumbbell eyes as well. And get it all together and pull out some of the loose fibers. And then stroke it all back. I'm going to wrap up right in front of the dumbbell eyes and pull that rabbit strip forward. Tie that down. Get that tied down pretty tight. Cut it off, cut off the tag. as close to the thread as you can and then put down some thread wraps to cover that up. I'm going to get some copper flashaboo 
to go on top of the rabbit strip for a little bit of flash. Get maybe a dozen fibers of this, and you want them to be just a little bit longer than the rabbit strip is when you tie them in. Tie those right on top. And cut off the extra. Clean that up a little bit. And trim these so they're just behind the rabbit strip. I'll get my whip finish. Tie off the head. Cut the thread and I'll put on a little UV to finish it off. Go ahead and cure that. That's the Miller Time Baby Brown.